that's that's weird when it doesn't doesn't do the thing that I wanted to do. Hello. Let's play some more Spyro. Spyro Year of the Dragon. The demo mode was playing for a second there. Give me a moment here. Give me a moment. A Spyro Year of the Drag a moment. Why is this like not right? I don't even know. Oh, that's the wrong title card. Whoops. Yeah. Just realize it's not like centered. There we go. Anyway, um, we are good to go. So let's do it. Okay. So let's see. Where were we? Sixty-one percent. I'm going about 30% each session, so, like, I might actually be able to finish it this session. Although, it m might not because of the Agent 9 levels, which I do not like whatsoever. Um, no, I need it. Because I can't do that yet. Still need to do Lost Fleet and Charmed Ridge. Okay. Did I not do the Honey Speedway thing? Oh, right, because Hunter's captured. That's right. Alright. Go to Lost Fleet. And then whatever the other place was that I can't remember. Right now, for some reason. around these parts, little dragon. There'll be more ghosts in this here shipyard than I can shake me pick at. Darn shame, too, because I was mighty close to finding me treasure. Crazy Ed. Crazy Ed and his treasure. I don't really remember Crazy Ed, I'll be honest. Oh, well. Um... <laughs> Look at that ghost! Ow. Ow. Anything with a throwable object is immediately annoying. Immediately. By the way, those horseshoe crabs are not horseshoe crabs. What am I talking about? Those, uh, just crabs, really. Crabs. They did nothing wrong, and yet you killed the shit out of them in this level. I just don't want to go charge that. There we go. get up there. I'm just being lazy and slow, I guess. Um, oh, okay. Uh-huh, yep. No, that's fine. Okay. Why do they have to make throwing enemies? 
God, I hate throwing enemies. I wonder if Twitch is actually fished. Fished? Fixed at this point. Hey, Yankee. How's it going? As soon as I say that, somebody shows up. <laughs> Yesterday, Twitch was having, like, real bad issues with showing people, apparently, or showing the, the site. So I wonder, I wonder if they are fixed. Like, I was okay for a little bit, but then I realized, then I, um, oops. Then I played, um, or then I, then I tried to look at my dashboard, and it was not okay. So it did not work. Couldn't get it for several, on for several hours yesterday. Yeah, I don't know what was happening. I saw, I was on the subreddit, uh, the other day, and I looked at it. Or I looked, I tried to see if anybody knew what was happening. And, like, everybody was like, I don't know why Twitch is doing this but it was so we are I mean I'm glad it's working now obviously because I'd like for people to be able to see me stream um but I don't know man Probably had a big update and update failed is my guess. I mean, that's a fair guess. I Honestly, I don't know. That one was asleep and now he is awake. It's a fair guess. Oh yeah, I remember why you need that. Get to go swimming in the goop. Swimming in the goop. Alright. So I don't know if I'm going to finish it today. Um, I might be able to finish the game today. I'll be honest. If I hurry. And if I don't fuck it up. I could potentially finish it today. Um, I don't know though. We'll see. I don't know why they try to force so many updates when they're so accustomed to having things a certain way and want the things... We like to stay the same. Well, that's not usually. I mean, they didn't change anything on Twitch, did they? I don't. I didn't see anything change, like actually change. So it's not anything like that. Don't even worry about that. It's like video game. You have to keep the things people like the same and only change the bad things you dislike, not to make too different. But yeah. But like, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's just. It's probably just like a maintenance thing or something. Because sometimes the servers need updating. Or, or anything like that, or it's just somebody needs to code something differently because it's inefficient. So it's probably just, it was probably just like, I don't know, just a thing that, I don't know, man. I took a, I took one programming class. <laughs> I'm not an expert, so. I don't know. Hey, I'm invincible. Crabs. Here, this one. Hey, CG. What up? How's it going? Didn't see you again yesterday. It's probably due to the Twitch thing. Were you having problems with Twitch yesterday as well? I think everyone was. But... I remember you said you were going to be back and then you never came back. And I assume Twitch problems. I keep tabs on everybody. <laughs> but also, I pay attention. Yes, I was. Figured. Yeah, I, I really... I We were speculating actually a second ago as to why. And... I imagine it's just some update, like Yankee said. Um, they fucked it all up. I don't know, though. They seem to have fixed it now, which is good. I was able to actually, like, change the shit on my stream, so...
Oh, shit. That's right. You can't. Because hunters. Yeah. Man, there's going to be a lot of shit that I can't do because hunter isn't here. That's really annoying. Okay. I've got to speed through this to get him back, actually. Now that I think about it. Because, uh... Can't 100% it without him. Sadly. I don't know, what's the, what's, <laughs> how's everybody feel about Hunter the Cheetah as a character? Because I'm like, eh, about him. Free Hunter, well yeah, no, I know. I, I know I have to, but like, I mean character-wise, you know? So I don't find him to be a particularly good side character, or support character, whatever. He's not really side character, but you play as him, I guess, a little bit, so I guess he's kind of one of those, but like, I don't find him to be very enjoyable. I just find him to be kind of unnecessary as a character. Man, here we go. Cause like, I understand having like a comic relief, but sometimes it's just overdone to the point of like, you don't, you don't like them. What the hell? Oh, good. My bot posted that I'm streaming, as it should. You know, I was making a joke. When rampers get locked up in jail, they make shirts that say free person. I didn't know that. Really. I don't know much about rap and all that. I'm not really into it. I don't need this, ex uh, this invincibility, but that's fine. And I disagree. I love Hunter. Okay. I mean, that's fair. These here waters used to be my favorite diving spot. Uh, but I can't get any loot with these subs patrolling around. Think you can pilot this here sub I bought for scrap? All righty then. I'll press the X button to speed on up. And when you get a sub in your sights, the torpedo will start to lock on. If you get a good lock on... Fire away with the circle button. Okay. I forgot about this minigame. Hip hip is my main- hip hip? Hip hop, yeah. Is your main genre? Okay. This was a really easy minigame now that I remember it. Spyro had some pretty cool minigames. I know that's a typo, I was just, I found it a little funny. Um. Damn it. Uh, hip hop is my main genre, what's your favorite genre? Um, probably like rock, like many f forms of it. I like classic rock, I like alternative rock, I like, um. Uh Well I'm I'm getting I'm getting more into like just soundtracks and synthwave and things without lyrics. I'm getting way more into that. Um So But I'm I'm more I'm I'm I like a lot of music. I just I don't like uh I'm not I'm not partial to rap or hip hop. Um and I don't like country music usually. Um but 
You give me some classic rock, you give me some, uh, you give me some synth wave, you give me some, uh, you give me some, uh, hell, classical music. Pretty into that, too, I'll be honest. There we go. Love soundtracks, too. Well, I'll be darned. You got some mean sub grabbing skills. Why don't you have this here egg as a reward? Here we go. Yeah, I love soundtracks too. Yeah, I've been listening to the Banished soundtrack, the XCOM soundtrack, the This War of Mine soundtrack. Well, I, I hate to ask your help again, but there be even more subs that darn come out of nowheres. If you could blast them, I could use this acid lake as my swimming hole again. He's a... Uh, Crazy Ed's real good at swimming in... Uh... Acid, apparently. It's kind of weird. Um, what else have I been listening to? I've also gotten real into listening to this one song. Uh, it's called uh, Data and Picard by Pogo. I didn't know about Pogo too much until I was shown this one song. And then I realized that I kind of knew him a little bit. I fucking love Data and Picard. It's hilarious. By hilarious, I just mean it, it genuinely entertaining for me. I like the fact that he took... Le uh, oh. Shit. Whoops. Well, I, I... They have game soundtracks for Spire 2 and 3, Halo 1 and 2, Ration and Clank 1 through 3, Crash Bandicoot, Wrath of Cortex. Okay. That's pretty cool. I, uh... I also have, like, the Sonic Generation soundtrack, I believe, somewhere. I haven't listened to it forever in forever, because I think it was on my iTunes, and I stopped using iTunes. And I never converted it to an MP3 to put on my phone. Um, come on, there we go. Yeah. Generations was way good with music. I mean, most Sonic games have really good music. Even if they're shit. <laughs> um, but no, I, I really like the Generations soundtrack because it was just remixes of classic stuff. Which now Mania has, basically. So I should really get the Mania soundtrack. Um, which I'm sure I could. That guy's just indecisive as fuck. One more sub. Can't fuck it up now. Where are you at? Man, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sonic uh, mayonnaise, actually. Oh, hey, really loud truck. submarine part is pretty hard for you. Yeah, I mean, the only difficult part for me is tracking them down and the ones that go in the tunnels forever. The, um... The mines are annoying, but... Long as you can track them down, it should be fine. It takes a good time. That's not gonna hit. That will, though. Goodbye. Sink, Manhattan. Yeah. <laughs> At last, the acid lake is safe for swimming again. <laughs> I wish I could reward you better, but all I got left is this here other egg. Maybe there'll be something better in this one. Something better. Not like a little dragon like you were looking for. Neither one that looks kind of like you, because it's another dragon. I don't know, man. I don't know what you dragons like. Is it treasure? It's treasure, ain't it? Well, I don't got no treasure for you. Because all that treasure's mine. 
Hey, what are you doing picking up all that treasure? This is my lake. My swimming hole. Take all my treasure? Well, we're gonna have a problem now, ain't we? Oh. I missed that one. Whoops. <laughs> Pardon the, uh... The terrible accent. <laughs> I just felt like being adventurous. That's all. Like one of them there adventure boys. You know. You know the tap. Dragons like not being eaten by Rhinox. That's fair. Cap. Depends on the type of eating. Can't get all the gems though because of the fucking not having Hunter around, so I can't get the skateboard, so I can't go, you know. Hey, could I use your sub real quick? Yep, thank you. Did it say ride the sub for cheap thrills? I think that's what it said. Wait a second, that's acid. Calm down. Go through that. There you go. Alright, there. Now I never have to go into this place again, I hope. Does not appear so. Sparks is not pointing at anything. Alright, let's get out of here, go to the next level, get that done, and then go to the fourth world after, uh... Fighting the boss, which I don't remember what the boss is after this world. Oh! I remember this. Hello, I thought you might be hungry. Thanks. Did you bring any chips? I'm sorry this happened, but I tried to warn you. I had to help Spyro rescue the eggs. You just don't understand. If we don't bring dragons back to this world soon, all our magic will be lost. The dragons used to live here? Yes. This was their original home. But a long, long time ago, the sorceress banished them to the other side of the world. Like a dick. She didn't realize the dragons were the source of all our magic. Maybe I could convince the dragons to come back, if you let me go. I'm sorry, I can't. Bye, Bianca. Thanks for nothing. Fucking asshole. Yo, so... You know what's the what's one of the most annoying things about reviewing movies? Or at least giving opinions on movies? Is recording the movie. Cause like I tried to record the movie that Alex and I did for Pastime Picture Show. And fucking oh Spyro, we urgently need your help. The evil cat wizards of Felinia have stormed our castle and captured our princess. If we don't stop them right away, they'll force her to marry Prince Azrael. I forgot about this. Um, the worst part is, is trying to record the movie because uh, some movies, especially if they're on Blu-ray, which I stupidly got uh, for this shitty, shitty movie, uh, are copyright like protected with DRMs. Um, oh, hey, calm down. Where'd you go? Oh. Um. They're copyright protected, and, uh. When you try to record it off a Blu ray player, well, it doesn't really work. Oh. 
Also, like, this fairy can just get past all these cat wizards, so, like, why why does it matter? Hurry, Spyro! If we don't get to the castle right away, the princess will be forced to marry that loser, Prince Azrael. That loser? Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember the story. Ow. Mm. Oh, money bags, that's right. I remember what you do here, too. Money, 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 money bags. Well, Spyro, today is your lucky day. The wizards and I have worked out a little deal. If you simply pay a small toll, they'll be happy to raise these steps and let you pass. You have chosen wisely, Spyro. I'll tell the wizards to raise the steps immediately. And uh, best of luck rescuing that princess. Or whatever it is you're up to. I love how he doesn't even know what the fuck's going on. He's just like, hey man, good luck. Thanks for the money. This level was like especially short, if I remember right. I know Sergeant Bird has a thing here, but I don't know. There is no time to lose. Prince Azrael and his cat armies are about to steal our poor princess. They're about to steal our poor princess. I will excessively roll my R's. R's. Oh no. Oh god. Oh jeez. God, you cat wizards are like the worst. Oh, did you not notice that you, you did that wrong? Oh, I'm really not gonna like being Agent 9. It's the worst. It's the worst part of the game, in my opinion. Why did I get? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Spyro. Isn't Prince Azrael just the greeniest? The other fairies and wizards won't let us get married, so we're going to elope. By the way, Azrael says you can have this egg if you don't tell anyone where we went. How do I- I don't know where you're going, I just know that you eloped, so like... Okay. Also, that cat has a skull earring. <laughs> it's the stupidest thing. It's so stupid. so stupid. Go, magic flying motorcycle! Godspeed, cat wizard! That was a silly game. Oh, okay. That was... What? I've never seen that n ever, like... Not let me go up here? Okay, weird. Um... I like how silly Spyro is. Gotta remember to do this. Sergeant Bird. Bird! Good day, Spyro. I'd like to stay and chat, but I'm late for a, uh, an engagement with a fairy friend of mine. Uh, she's just a friend, you understand. It's a strictly platonic relationship. 
It's certainly not a violation of military protocol whatsoever. <clears throat> what? What are you giving me that look for? <laughs> He's in love. Where have you been, James? We were supposed to meet in the temple an hour ago. And don't give me that old matters of national security line again. Well, I guess it doesn't matter, though. The whole temple is full of nasty cat witches anyway. We'll just have to call off our date. That is, unless you want to battle the witches. Yeah, I'll battle the witches. I'm ready. Look at me battling witches with missiles. Are you impressed yet? Are you impressed yet? Do you love me? Fairy. I think I got them all. Nope. I did. So, I see those rocket launchers aren't just for show up. Aha! Well, I just hope your accuracy is better than your punctuality. Um, because there are still a lot more witches in the temple. Okay, here we go. Guess what? I can hit mo uh I can hit a lot of them before they come at it. Oh. Come at me. Ow. There. If I just keep firing, I kind of just win. I must admit, James, I am impressed. There are still a few witches left though, and this time they mean business. They even turned the floor into deadly blue ooze. Oh, be careful, okay? Okay. I'll be careful. I'm just gonna keep hitting circle anyway. It's uh... You know, this time is not as effective with the just hitting circle part. Ow! Ow! That's not cool, man. Don't do that. Hey. Boom. You did it, James. I knew you weren't the leader of the Hummingbird Resistance Movement for nothing. Now we have the temple all to ourselves. But first, I have a present for you. Is an egg. But duty calls. Sergeant, you're not allowed to have the romance. Not yet. No, no, no. Duty first. You must save the world. Then you can be as romantic as you like. Maybe. He's up to the general. I don't know if general is higher than sergeant or the other way around. I'll be honest. I wasn't gonna make that. I just wanna get to those though. That's that's really it. <laughs> there we go. Get sparks all the way full. I should probably not kill myself. There we go. Just useful advice for life, really. Probably not kill myself. Oh, what? What is fairy there now? Why was fairy there? Okay, sure. Mhm. Mm Do I have to redo the the moving vols? Ow! Ow! Come on! Oh, or I, or I could just fuck it all up and die. That's also something I could have done. Why am I over here? I do have to redo the boss. <laughs> Whoa. 
There we go. So yeah, I had two cups of coffee, which is the equivalency of four cups of coffee at the moment. I'm up there. I forgot about that egg. Hmm. It's like really easy one to get. <laughs> yeah. If only, you know, you were used for something better later on, tiny baby dragons. And not enter the dragonfly. It really wasn't your call, was it? No, no, no. You were just babies. You cannot make judgment calls. I don't know what I'm doing anymore, dude. I don't know what I'm doing with my... With the accents and all this. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna play the game. Um... There we go. Is that where it was? Oh, I thought it was farther back. That's fine. That's fine. Youngling for talking about children in Star Wars. How do they do that? I know that's completely out of left field, but I was just wondering that now. Why did they do that? It's really dumb. Need to get up there. Did I not hit the other one? As well? No, I did. Where is it? I don't remember. But no, like, actually though, like, why, why call them younglings? Because, like, yeah, they're young, but, like, they're children. Just call them children. Hey, Z boy. I see you're in chat now. What up, dude? I'm just having a thought, which is dangerous. Yeah. Does like the vase reset if you take too long? I don't think so. But like now I'm unsure. Oh no, it's over there. Durr. And then it goes there. Yeah, okay. Let me get this first before I go do the, um... That. Right there. But no, like... It's bugging me now. It's bugging me now. It's been... How long has it been since the prequels? It's been too long. Why is it bugging me now? <laughs> It's just call them children. 
Like, I'm pretty sure even space aliens would be like, yeah, those are my kids, if they're speaking in galactic. Or whatever it is their dialect is called, that's the common of their dialect. Since common is the name of it in D&D. &D. Like... It's bugging me! It's bugging me way more than it should. I think. Younglings. Fucking younglings, dude. I guess there's no real good explanation for anything that came out of Lucas's head afterwards. Even before, technically, but like... <laughs> Younglings, dude. Is this a hunter thing? I hope this isn't a hunter thing. No. Oh, right. Yeah. Hey. According to legends, there's a golden goose at the top of this here mountain. I want to be the first person to the top so I can grab it. I just bought some Insta Sprout Ultra Super Grow seeds from a bear with a bag of mm. He said they were magic. But I can't make them do anything. You can have a couple if you like. I would like them, yeah. Alright. So first. These uh these seeds are actually really neat. In the sense of like oh. They make different plants that have different properties. Building off of the Spyro 2 seeds that the professor gave you, which did really nothing except for make platforms of, speci of specifying heights and sizes when, uh, when necessary, basically. And I really don't like the fact that sometimes it just doesn't do the thing that you want it to do when it's right there. I'm gonna be amazed if that actually made the flower up there when I was nowhere near it. I think I just saw it, actually. Oops. Oh, goodness. No, no, no. Could you just, like, actually just auto-aim it a little bit? Because it's not... Thank you. Not an exact science, I know. It did make the flower. I'm actually impressed with myself. And also the game. More so the game. I found this egg on the way up here. I think it was laid by a golden goose. We'll have to keep going. We're almost to the top. He's got blush. You see that? His face is like blushed a little bit. For no reason. You've been doing great so far. Why don't you take two more seats? Thanks. Wow. He's got that anime look. Hey, Crackshaw. Yeah, he does. How's it going, Crackshaw? How are you doing? I didn't mean that to sound weird. Too bad. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. 
I'm repeating myself, repeating myself, apparently. Um, but no, that's good. Glad to hear it. Hey, Aiden, I see you're in the chat. What up, dude? So when I started, I was apparently 61% done with the game. Which means I could potentially finish it today. Though, with the three hours that I have, I don't know. We'll see. But if I do finish it today, it'll be perfect poetry and symmetry, because... <laughs> well, thank you for the bits! Wait. I don't need that there. I... Thank you for the bits, I appreciate it. Um... <laughs> hey! Uh... Oh, wait a minute. No. That's not necessary. Dang, Adolf, you sneaky. Right? <laughs> uh... Oh, I know why. You get this so you can go exchange it. That's right. The bits are frozen on the screen. Thank you, Zebor. Uh, Streamlabs, why do you do this sometimes? There you go. We good. So the, apparently the reason that Insomniac stopped developing Spyro was because they couldn't give him hands. Or he didn't have hands, so he couldn't, like, manipulate objects. But, like, or carry anything. But, like, he's got a mouth, dude. I don't use that. You finish building PC and only have to update drivers and install Windows 10. Nice, dude. Sorry you have to install Windows 10, but, like, other than that, nice, dude. Fuck. Precise uh, platforming is unnecessary. See, he gets up here no problem. At last, I get like the legendary golden goose. You can have another one of its eggs for a souvenir. The legendary golden goose. That's the ugliest goose I've ever seen. <laughs> I remember that too. Alright, and now the only thing left is that little part down there. I don't know if you can do this. Yeah, you can. Alright. Little part down here. I guess you could say Insomniac. Carried on. <laughs> yeah. You could. You could. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. This is probably gonna take one more session. So, probably Tuesday I will finish this game, because there are still skill points that I haven't done, which might take me a bit. And, uh, the Agent 9 stuff is gonna take me a while, because I hate it. <laughs> it's one of the few things that I dislike about 3, which is why 2 is my favorite, because it has very little that I dislike. Alright, let's get to the rocket. So we can move on and free hunters so we can actually complete levels again. Hey. Midnight Mountain. Pop 
about them two days ago. Yep, that's true. Monster tend all monsters. That's it. I've had enough. I'm going to create a monster to end all monsters. <laughs> and I'm going to send it out to destroy all the dragons, even the little hatchlings. Yes, yes! It will smash them and crush them and grind them and tear them! Oh, yes! Smear them and smoosh them and crack them and crease them! But, uh, won't that kill them? <laughs> that doesn't matter! As long as I can still collect their wings! What? All this time you only wanted them for their wings? Of course, you ignorant girl. I need them for a spell, so I can live forever! Uh, uh, wait, wait a second. A, a spell? What did you think I was going to do with all those dragons? Open a zoo? <laughs> you said just keeping them in our world was enough. You never said you had to kill them. I don't have to kill them. It just stops them from wriggling so much. You're terrible. I can't believe I ever listened to you. Stupid insolent brat. I'll take care of her as soon as I finish off that dragon. Now, where was I? Ah, yes! <laughs> Still less of a douche than money bags. Oh, he'll get what's coming to him. You know it. I know it. It's great. I don't remember this boss, but I might as soon as we get there. I remember this boss. This might be our last stand, Spyro. The sorceress plans to use this monster to destroy every iota of her opposition, beginning with the two of us. Alas, there is no time for ruminating. A battle awaits us. I will endeavor to assist you by means of a steady provision of combustible projectiles. Thanks. Stop using your fucking Saurus, though, dude. Not necessary. Was the oh, there it is. Ah! No! Easiest boss ever. Jumps. Oh fuck, that's the most impressive baby dragon I've seen, actually. That's like a full out inferno, dude. Thanks, dude. I might want to go to the police and let him know you may have touched a thesaurus inappropriately. The escape. Or an escape. Bianca, did you bring any more food? I'm starving. There's no time for that, Hunter. We have to stop the sorceress. She's gonna kill all the dragon hatchlings. Wait a minute. Why should I trust you? This could be another trap. You're in a cage, you furry numbskull. How can I trap you by letting you out? I don't know. You sorceress types can be sneaky. I never thought we were gonna hurt the dragons. Come on, we don't have time for this. Did you know the voice actor for Bentley is also the Codex narrator for in the Mass Effect games? I didn't know that. That's cool. I like the dude who voices Bentley, I'll be honest.
Who's the guy that voices money bags? I like him too. He's got a perfect sleazy car salesman voice. Spyro, I know you don't trust me, but I want to help you stop the sorceress. There's a way to open a hidden portal to her lair, but it'll take some very strong magic. If you can find more of the dragon eggs, I think my magic will be strong enough to open the portal. I'll come find you when you have enough eggs, okay? I think I already have enough eggs. Name is Neil Ross and is also the voice actor for Bentley. Oh, really? It's bo They're both the same person. I didn't even think about that. I haven't been paying attention to like the similarities in their voices. Because I haven't had them one after another, so like I haven't been thinking about it. That makes sense. Neil Ross is cool. I like his voice, then. Zaki! Um, or as a certain dwarf would say. Zaki! Well, well, Spyro, look what I have here. It's a life-size space monkey action figure, complete with a fully operational laser. I'd love to let him out so you can play with him, but the sorceress seems to think he's a menace. I fucking hate Agent 9. You've always had a weakness for helping silly little creatures, haven't you, Spyro? Oh, well, I suppose there couldn't be any harm in letting him out. Could there? So boring, and this gameplay is awful. Except for one level. I think it's his first level. I've been captured. If you happen to see the sorceress, tell her I'll be giving her dancing lessons real soon. Know what I mean? You bet. Later. I don't care for Agent Nine. <laughs> the original voice actor for Spyro was also in Reno 911 and The Fairly Odd Parents. Oh, really? Carlos uh, Al Al. Uh, not yet. Carlos Al uh, Al 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 something. It's Spanish. That's all I know. I don't know if it's specifically a Spain name, but he's Spanish. This I know. I was Rocky. Sorry, not Spanish. Why did I think Spanish? That's not right. That's not Spanish at all. Brain. Is it? I don't fucking know. Don't, don't. Voices Mr. Crocker? Oh my god. That's so weird. That's kind of, that's really weird because you get Mr. Crocker and Mr. Krabs together. Is, uh, what's his face? Uh, god, I know his name now. I, I remember his name, but I don't remember his name, you know? I thought Spanish because Carlos. Yeah, I know. How in the fuck? Yeah, um... But no, uh, what's his face? Uh, I know his name. Did that dragon have a butterfly in her egg? Oh. Magic? Fuck you. I don't know, right? She cuffed it up. Magic? Don't you know? He also voiced Rocco. Yeah, I know that. I knew that. I didn't know he was Crocker, though. That's cool. But no, the guy who voiced Mr. Krabs was in one, because he's all the dragons. Or, at least some of the dragons. Quincy... I think something... Something Quincy or Quincy something? That's, that's in my brain for that. I don't remember what his name is. 